Hey, Gemini, welcome to your reading. These messages may or may not resonate. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe. Let's tap in. Let's get a quick reading for you. All right, so let's do the current energy for Gemini. Tell me what you need them to know right now at this time. Spirit guides, angels, and ancestors, allow me to be a vessel for Gemini. Sun, moon, rising, Venus, and the North Node. Allow me to be a vessel for Gemini. Somebody here. Um, whoever this is, that could have been doing some damn um, magic. Whatever this is, trying to cause chaos and hostility is not working. Okay? This could be a Leo or somebody here is lying. They're trying to lie or it's not working, Gemini. Somebody's trying to cause chaos or they're trying to avoid some type of tower with the tower in reverse. Literally, what's the message is Gemini? Yeah, I feel like somebody's still going to get justice from these fake-ass people here that's been talking shit, been gossiping, rumor. This could be a coven, a group of people, okay, that could be getting ready to experience some type of karma. What's the messages for Gemini? Somebody's been trying to manipulate someone. Yeah, we have a king of wands in reverse. A lion-ass uh, fire sign. A Leo. We have the Knight of Swords, your energy coming right out, Gemini. So somebody's scattered, they're unfocused in regards to something. Why is the Knight of Swords in reverse? So something here is unpredictable. Yeah, the Temperance, Sagittarius energy. So I feel like this Sagittarius is scattered, unfocused, or they're very impulsive, or this Sagittarius, or this Gemini um, did something unpredictable and now they're trying to have a disregard for the consequences or whoever this temperance is somebody could, could have possibly did something when they were drunk or um this could have been some type of impulsive behavior somebody's crazy i feel like this person's they did this in the excess now what's what's going on with this sagittarius yeah they're going through karma will of fortune in reverse damn so this is someone here that did something stupid and now they're on the bottom of the wheel give me the temperance and it's a heavy sag and yeah heavy sagittarius nine of wands that's irritated they're frustrated they're mad they're angry about something or they feel in some type of way i feel like there's trouble coming out about the sagittarius because of what they did on impulse mm. What's the nine of wands and the temperance shouldn't it do what you did dumbass we have the fool yep literally the fool in reverse the nine of swords in reverse. So somebody took a risk or they did something very, very foolish. They made some type of bad decision. They took a risk or um, Gemini. This is Aquarius energy as well. Um, Sagittarius as well. Okay, so I feel like this could be some type of secret coming out or maybe you're releasing worry. Mm, Gemini, but I feel like you're not you're not upset. You're not worried anymore or you're not fearful or you're not going through any you're not having any type of turmoil any nightmares. It's over with but I feel like whoever this is that could have um that should have held back with making this bad choice or taking this risk they could They could be worried. Okay, or they could be very hesitant. Yeah, the two of wands somebody's getting restricted or they're being held up this was poor planning that somebody decided to do. I mean, whatever they did, man, what's the fool in reverse? Yeah, somebody wanted to invest in this high priestess. This was a bad decision. Somebody wanted to invest in this person. Yeah, I feel like somebody knows what somebody has been planning this this time. This, okay, so Gemini, somebody knows. There's a high priestess that knows either what you've been planning or what the Sagittarius has been planning. They know. Somebody's been trying to dig some type of ditch for someone or dig a grave or whatever this is. I look at the Seven of Pentacles as digging a ditch, digging a grave because they have that shovel. Well, it's like a shovel. It's a stick. But I look at it like a shovel. They have, um, they have that in their hand. And I feel like the high priestess knows this. So the Knight of Swords could have an accomplice. So this could be a Gemini and a Sagittarius that, that are hitmans or the, not, the Gemini is supposed to be a hitman and the Sagittarius is supposed to be a hitman. Place yourself where you belong at. Or you could have Gemini placements. Somebody in here got Gemini placements. There's a Gemini in here that's supposed to be a hitman. And the High Priestess knows about what this person has been planning because somebody done they done fell into their own trap doing something stupid and dumb. They were very reckless. And now they're trying to what? So this is the karma. Yeah, the two of cups and the moon. Okay, so yeah, the fool in reverse. Give me more on this fool in reverse, please. We have the hierophant. 
This could be with the institution, bank. Um, somebody did something dumb in this organization with this banking or fraud or something like that. Hold on. So there was a bad choice. Somebody decided to do something to this institution. Now, the institution could be banks. Uh, it could be, uh, this could be a government entity. So whoever this is, they could be married and they, they both did something stupid. They both did something reckless. They made a bad, they took a risk. Yep. Okay. So now they don't want to work together anymore with the three of pentacles, the six of pentacles in reverse. Somebody is not in love because they know that this person's a warlock that wants to come in and reconcile all to cause conflict. Yep. The five of wands, the queen of cups in reverse, the ten of swords. Yeah. What's the hierophant? The fool in reverse. The eight of cups. Somebody waited until they left to do this. Yeah, now they're disappointed. They're like, oh, I'm just going to withdraw. Let me just try to. It's now they're trying to leave. After they done, done took a risk, okay, with this organization, a bank, Um, now they're trying to walk away. They're like, no, nah, I'm just going to leave it behind. I'm good. Yeah, uh-uh. Somebody's no longer. Give me the high priest of seven of pentacles, man. Yep, the Knight of Cups. Somebody knows that this person could have been trying to have a one-night stand with them. Knowing that they're going through bad karma. So it's like somebody's trying to get out of their karma. The Five of Swords in reverse. They're trying to make amends so that way they can get out of some type of karma and move forward here with the chariot. But there has been clarity received. Okay, or somebody's making a choice on love. Okay, because the Queen of Swords in reverse could be a lying ass hoe. Or this person, I don't know, y'all. <laughs> Give me the Knight of Cups in reverse. So I feel like somebody wanted to make a, yeah, the Knight of Wands and the Knight of Cups in reverse. Somebody wanted to have a one night stand, okay? Or they wanted to intentionally give you an STD. Somebody wanted to intentionally pass something to somebody here. A King of Cups. We have the Knight of Wands in reverse. So there's a lot of scattered energy, delay. Somebody's frustrated. This could be like sexual frustration. All right. Maybe somebody didn't have some, they didn't have, they haven't had none in a while and they're sexually frustrated or whatever this is. Okay. We have the emperor and the three of wands. So this could be an Aries. The Aries is no longer waiting or Aries does not have any foresight. This could be some type of unexpected delays coming to this Aries here, the eight of pentacles because of something that they try to do over and over again. This could be a boss, a father figure, a CEO. Yeah. This person's uninspired. They're not able to move forward in life because they're always stuck in the past. Or, yeah, so a cycle is ending. A cycle is closing between, um, yeah. What's next for Gemini? We have the five of wands in reverse. So somebody's trying to avoid some type of conflict here. Yeah. So there's no more competition. Somebody's avoiding conflict here because either they got caught trying to steal something or take something from someone. They got caught. They've been caught. Red handed. Literally. Somebody got caught right in their tracks. Now they're trying to avoid conflict and they're trying to respect either your differences or or whatever this is. So who was the one that had got caught? So who got caught? Who was stealing? Who was the seven of swords? The Knight of Pentacles in reverse. Whoever this is, their money is slow. Yep. Look, there could be repeated calls, people calling, arguing, the five of wands, the eight of wands. Like, oh man, it's a lot. It's a lot of conflict going on. Mm hmm. So, whoever this is, they were greedy. Okay. Or whoever this is, they're, they're being underpaid. Somebody's not getting paid for the work that they're doing. And so this is why they're being a thief or or they, they're trying to steal because they're, they're moving. They're, the reason why they're trying to steal, okay, is because things are moving slow in their life. They're not able to make money. Somebody's too superficial or they're not reliable. They're not responsible at all. Give me the 10% reverse, child. It's a queen of wands. It's a Sagittarius. That could be highly unstable or the Sagittarius is going to jail. Eight of Swords, or they feeling trapped. Mm -hmm. The Nine of Cups. Okay. 
So this person could be playing victim right along with this um, warlock and ass king of wands. So this queen of wands could have um, fire. Definitely could have fire. Anything else for Gemini? Yep, secrets is coming out. Everything is about to be revealed, okay? So maybe you could be releasing fear or somebody, something is about to be revealed to you. Somebody's losing their home. The four of wands, the world card. It's over. What's the moon in reverse? We have the six of pentacles. Yes, somebody's paying for something to be revealed. What's, what's this being revealed? The ace of pentacles about somebody's opportunities or what somebody was given to do something. I don't know. What's the ace of pentacles? The ten of cups. Yeah, so I feel like somebody paid somebody to like uh, break up with someone. The seven of swords. They're like, well, I need you to break up with that water sign. Break up with that um, Cancer, Scorpio, or Pisces. Okay, or there's a, a there's a Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces that's coming clean about what they paid to do. Yeah. So there's a practitioner that's refusing to compromise or whoever this practitioner is, they must have did something very foolish. And now they could be very rigid or this is someone that could have a chip on their shoulder. Now they're holding back. Yeah, heavy on that somebody's holding back because either they found out that somebody was a liar, the lack of ideas with the Ace of Swords in reverse. Somebody found out that somebody was a liar here with the Ace of Swords in reverse. That they were causing conflict or they were being very hostile. Yep. Mm-hmm. Or they were lying on somebody's real, true, genuine partner. Saying that this person wasn't a healer or that this person was in despair. And they were forcing a king of pentacles to awaken. Because a king of swords could have been lying or an air sign could have been lying. Could have been a Gemini or somebody could have been lying about the love that they have for someone. Or why they ignored them. They could have been lying. Like, well, this is the reason why I ignored this person. Somebody's going through a backfire. All these lies, man. All this shit is coming out. Somebody's going through a backfire. I feel like somebody has to come clean. Yep, like I said, spell work you did has backfired. Yep. We have Cancer, Pisces. We have Aries, Energy. We have Scorpio. So there's a tower. And I feel like somebody's not going to see this tower coming or they're not going to see this destruction coming to them. Because they trapped. Yep. They got they got they they got lack of foresight. They're not gonna see this tower. Whoever this is that did this spell work, they're finna lose. What's this spell work they had did? Yep, by trying to cause candle magic. Somebody was literally doing candle magic. Clarify that. And they was managing this shit. Candle magic. Yep, the ace of cups on somebody's ace of cups on their true love. Somebody was doing um, candle magic so that someone doesn't see who they love with the Ace of Cups. I feel like if you were if you were with someone, Gemini, or say like um, it's like somebody doesn't want you to see the love that you have for someone. They don't want you to invest or build. They want you to waste your time being in a Five of Cups. But this is not gonna this is not gonna put you in the Emperor energy. They want you to be a distorted masculine. Somebody wants you to be distorted. They want you to be, I don't know. But whatever this is, I feel like someone does just not want you to be happy or they don't want you to have a new beginning in love or um, maybe somebody's trying to fuck with somebody's fertility as well. Um, they're trying to do a number of things to this person. Womb magic.
Yeah, they all going through karma. The will of fortune is the reverse. They all are about to experience some type of upheaval. And I'm getting everybody that's involved that could have been trying to dig a ditch. They're about to lose out on their finances. This is about to be, this is some type of bad business um, that these energies, yeah. All because they wanted to start a lie. The Ace of Swords, 1515. As soon as I said that, all because they wanted to create some type of hostile or they wanted to be hostile towards you or they wanted to make up a lie or make up some type of rumors. The Three of Cups in reverse is literally somebody here making up rumors. They're mad because they're not following their calling. We have the judgment in reverse. This could be a lot of people that's not following their calling. So they could be very indecisive or um, they're just not in their head, like in their right mind. These people could be in karmic lessons or they're unwilling to learn some type of karmic lesson. So yeah, they have to make things unclear. They have to lie because they're karmic energies that juggle the two of pentacles. Yeah. And now they're refusing to compromise or maybe this is you. Maybe you're refusing to compromise or maybe you feel foolish or this is a Sagittarius. Yeah. I feel like you're ghosting people. You're not saying too much of anything to nobody because it's too much going on. The five of wands. People are mad because of where you're overcoming some type of obstacles here. Yeah. Anything else? And let's close it. We have, yeah, you're not with your real person. And that's just on period. This is a forced connection. You're forced to be with a fake ass lover. Just period, Gemini. Your fake ass lover is forcing you to be with them. We have the Ten of Wands and the real, true, genuine partnerships in love, friendship, soul tribe. That's in reverse. So you're not even with your real person. Just period. You're not. Somebody's doing dark magic or they're being very manipulative, vindictive, spiteful, and evil. And that's just what it is. And I'm going to keep speaking the truth. Whoever this Capricorn is, they're going through a backfire for attacking your, your Empress or um, attacking this, this Taurus Libra energy. They're going through a backfire. Yep. And that's just what it is. We have bad magic in the tower. Somebody's magic is literally blowing up in their face right fucking now as I'm saying this. Or it's, it's going to be. Anything in closing. Yep. Five of Wands. Conflict. Rivalry. Strife. Competitiveness. Mm-hmm. Well, Gemini, let me see if I could get something else real quick. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Somebody was doing something in the excess, child. What's the messages here? Yep, this facade. It's, it's time for this facade to like, uh-uh. It's time for this shit to end. What's going on? Yep, we have a gift. Because I feel like there's equal give and take. Presence, rewards, generosity, romantic, appreciated, taken for granted forever. It's give towards yourself. Yeah. We have cage. We have cheerfulness. Somebody wants to laugh at keeping somebody stuck. Feeling of being trapped, literally. Somebody wants to keep you stuck and they're laughing. They're going out with their friends. They're inviting them out, having a good time about keeping somebody trapped, stuck in a prison, limitations, loneliness, feeling a loss of freedom, feelings of guilt or shame. Stop punishing yourself. Yep, somebody did some cheating shit for money. What's the messages? Yeah, it could be a friend that want to fix something between y'all. Or they want to tell you the truth about this gossip. Talking about others behind their back. Yeah, somebody wants to tell the truth about some type of gossip now. Or slander. Mm-hmm. All right, anything else? Yeah, we have the enemy. Somebody traveled to an enemy to get, some type of, to get someone to gossip on them. To make somebody gossip about them, we have ship and enemy. Somebody literally traveled or they took a vacation long distance to this enemy. And then what? For this enemy. They were meeting, running errands. They were being, they were being, um, they were teaming up together for what? To get some type of surprise. What was the surprise? Yeah, money. So what was this team up? What was this effort? So somebody's losing a home, literally. House and loss. It's 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 a wrap. Yep, yeah. and somebody is sick here. They need to go to the doctor. That was your reading, Gemini. Like, comment, subscribe, turn your notification bell on so you're not missing my videos. I'm gonna leave it there. Bye.